Hi, I'm Christy Overton Johnson. I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you so much for your support, especially of our Victorious Living Outreach. Our magazine is reaching so many people across the United States, especially incarcerated men and women, and we could not do that if it wasn't for you. We did go to press uh, just about a week ago, and I believe that our magazines have hit the postal system. So you should have your first bilingual copy in the next week or two. And so when you get it and you open it up, if it seems like, oh my goodness, I don't can't read this, flip it over and read the other side because one side's Spanish and one side's English. So don't think that uh, you can't read it and throw it in the trash. It's, it's going to have English and Spanish, just depends on which direction that you're reading it. And we're so excited about that because 32% of the prison population is Hispanic. And this is going to give our ministry an opportunity to reach people in a whole new way. And we're also able to take those translated stories and now put them on Facebook and um, all over Instagram and reach so many more people with the gospel of Jesus Christ. And so I just wanted to share that with you. If you don't get your copy soon, please let us know. Give us give us two or three weeks because it is mail, media mail, and it takes a little bit of time, but be on the lookout for it. And when you finish, pass it on. Please don't throw it in the trash. Leave it somewhere. If you're done with it, either give it to someone or just leave it at a doctor's office or wherever someone will let you now with all this COVID stuff, but share it because those stories um, just have such an impact. And that's what I love about our magazine in prison. Every dollar that is given to our ministry sends one magazine into prison. And that magazine stays in prison for many, many, many years. And multiple people read that magazine. We know that probably within the first month or so, 10 people read one copy of each magazine. And so over the years, those hundreds of thousands of magazines that are sent in touch millions of lives. And so I just want to thank you. No matter what amount you send us, it is making an impact for years to come. So thank you very much. And um, if there's anything that we can do for you, would you please call us? We want to pray with you. We'd love to share more about our ministry, or maybe ways that you can be involved. And we also, we just don't want to touch other people's lives. We want to be there for you. So if you have a specific prayer need, call us, 352-478-2098. We have a great team. We have um, a Hispanic director. Uh, Denise, sorry, <laughs> Denise San Miguel, who's going to be on the cover of our next issue. If so, if you know someone that needs to speak to someone in Spanish, we have Denise and we also have Pat Avery. And um, if you know someone that is incarcerated who needs encouragement, Linda Cubbage Smith and Darlene Watson and all of our um, team, we have like 40 writers uh, that are working with Linda and Darlene. They are ready to send encouragement. I don't know if you know it, but we have thousands and thousands of inmates who are being corresponded with. And now we are connecting them also to our partners with CLI Prison Alliance and also Rescued Not Arrested out of um, Arizona. And we are getting Bibles to um, inmates through them, Christian books, and also English and Spanish Bible studies in addition to what we're sending. And so it's exciting. These are exciting times. Yes, they're scary times, but for us, we see God moving like he's never moved before. And hopefully in the last week or so, you received a letter that I sent out and it's from my heart. I hope that you'll take time to read it and see all the amazing things that God has done. I just want you to know that you're a part of that and we appreciate it. Thank you.